Hello, my name is Krista Fair, and today I'm going to be going over some of uh, the aspects of careers in graphic design. So, um, to start off with, um, I believe that uh, graphic, uh, uh, one of the most important, uh, Donovan, can you start my slideshow? No, start running my slideshow on the wirecast. Run the slideshow on the wirecast. Change the scenes. Don't keep it stagnant. Um Okay, let me I guess I'll start over. Um, my name is Krista Fair, and today I'm going to be going over with you some of the uh, uh, aspects of careers in graphic design. And um, just to start off with, I believe that uh, creativity is one of the um, main uh, um, assets that um, employers look for in this field. And um, uh, I'll just go to the next slide. Um, the task for uh, graphic designers is um, you uh, have to create uh, de uh, designs that um, satisfy what your um, client uh, has instructed, I suppose, um, that they'll tell you what they want and then you have to sketch it out and uh, maybe give some of your own input as to what you believe uh, should be created um, for the design for them, but also st uh, stick to their guidelines about what they want. Um, so they'll be happy with your works and possibly recommend you to other uh, um, colleagues of theirs so you can get uh, more business. Um, basically, you, as a graphic designer, you create logos, product visuals, websites, uh, and uh, many other types of products, such as the product itself. Um, packages for the products, uh, just almost anything um, that needs design is created by uh, graphic designers. Um, basically technical skills, you must be able to use computer technologies, uh, programs such as Adobe Photoshop and CorelDRAW, which are two industry standard basic uh, graphic design programs which are available through their, say, um, Adobe and uh, CorelDRAW uh, websites. And there are also certifications available for both of these, but I'll get to those in a little while. So next is we have some uh, details of the career. Um, graphic design jobs are growing within the country at about a 10% rate, which is a little bit higher than other uh, careers in uh, media. Uh, the, in, within the entire U.S., there's about 25,000 available jobs for graphic designers, but in Pennsylvania, there's only about 100, so... Um, you might want to consider moving into bigger cities. We'll have more uh, companies that will need graphic designers or possibly find um, a state that offers more jobs uh, for graphic designers. And uh, the average salary of a graphic designer um, is 44000 uh, a year. Um, for education, um, 
there are associates and bachelor's degrees available, of course, most likely masters too, uh, through colleges for graphic design. These aren't 100% necessarily required, but for many of the entry level positions, companies uh, moreover want those with bachelor's degrees because that shows that you know the course, you know um, exactly what it means to be a graphic designer and how to be more effectively productive for uh, the company. Um, you can also get, as I mentioned earlier, certifications for certain graphic creation softwares such as Adobe, which um, I believe are available online at about 100 to 200 dollars a piece, which may seem like a lot at the time, but in the long run, they really um, will boost um, how you look to an, uh, an employer. Um, and just to list some of my resources, um, I used um, ONET online, which is just a basic site to give summaries and information about different types of uh, media careers. Uh, Indeed.com is a job search engine which can help you find jobs available in your area. And Ledet is a site used to find certifications such as I mentioned before, the Adobe software that um, are available online to those uh, wanting to uh, boost their knowledge for um, softwares to um, uh, like I said, show uh, an employer that um, you know what you're doing with the softwares and are a certified, say, Adobe user. So, um, that's my presentation on graphic design and I hope you learned something.